Should I be looking here? I'll look here. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kara and I make career, travel, and lifestyle content here on YouTube. So if any of that interests you, you already know what I'm about to say. Make sure that you are subscribed to my channel and you turn on the bell so that you're notified anytime a new video goes live. All right, you guys. So if you watched my last video, then you know that I'm currently doing, I have this goal to record 10, record and upload. That's the important part, upload 10 videos in a row. So I uploaded last week and in that video I had mentioned that I was batch recording on that day and I did. I recorded another video but when I was watching it back and I started to edit it I didn't really like it. So I was like mm, I'm not going to force it but I also didn't want to miss a week and then have to start over on my goal. So hence this video we're gonna do like a very relaxing nighttime get ready with me for work tomorrow usually on mondays i work from home but tomorrow i have a really big meeting that's all day and it's in person so i need to go to the office so this is gonna be like a get ready with me reset type video as you can tell my bed is not made Okay, so we have to do that. I did wash my sheets, so my sheets are clean. I just need to put them on my bed. I need to wrap my hair. I need to take my makeup off, which I feel like looks really good today, by the way. My face is breaking out like a little bit, but I still feel like my makeup looked really good. I went to brunch um, earlier today with my line sisters and then have pretty much just been chilling on the couch since I got home. I ordered pizza for us for dinner, so we had Domino's for dinner and so we didn't have to cook which means i didn't meal prep so i have to do that at some point this week probably tomorrow night i'll end up cooking um when i get home from work but um yeah that's what we're about to do right now we're just gonna do a little reset video i'm gonna do a little chit chat and we're gonna you know get ready for bed i'm gonna try to be in the bed by 11 and it's like I don't know. Alexa, what time is it? 9.35. Okay. It's 9.35. So I feel like we can do it. We don't have that much to do. Um, but let's just like hop into it.
Okay, y'all, time check. So it's about 10.15 and we're doing great. My bed is made, flowers are all put out. I try to get fresh flowers every week for my room and then for the living room. I'll show y'all that in a second. And then eucalyptus for my shower. So all of that is done. Really quick, I wanna show y'all some room updates that I've made. So on Friday, I had someone come so that he could hang my mirror. I could have done it, but since he was already coming to hang the TV, I was like, just can you go ahead and do this for me too? So I don't have to worry about it. So we hung this mirror and then I got this little bookshelf. Well, it's not a bookshelf. It's like a dresser, a small dresser from Amazon because I felt like I needed some more like drawer space because that is my only dresser or was my only dresser. So I ended up flipping my room around. So my dresser used to be on this wall. My bed used to be on this wall. We flipped it around. We mounted my TV. As the guy was taking the pictures off the wall, they are like command strips. He was he ripped the paint off. So um, I'm going to have to basically put try to put the pictures over the patches and then I'm going to like cover my strings so that you can't see that, you know, stuff hanging down. And then this side will be done like my perfumes up there. And then um, over here is my little reading nook. Got a little reading corner over here. <coughs> oh, I guess that'll help. I was zoomed in quite a bit. But yeah, a little reading nook over here. And then I also want to finish decorating this shelf. I kind of just put what I had up here. But I want to just add a couple more pieces to like bring it together. And then, yes, my bed, like I said, is up against this wall now. And I actually really like it this way. It feels a lot more spacious. So, and then I have that picture up there, but I might change that and get like two or three like big pictures to cover that wall. But yeah, this is the room update. Hopefully we'll finish here soon. I, st I started this like a, f a few weeks ago and I just haven't really been finished. I've been putting off like getting someone to come hang this stuff. This was like the last thing that I needed. I was waiting on to like bring everything else together. So now that this is done, I can actually start putting the finishing touches on my room. I also may get a couple new pillows for my bed and I definitely want to get another throw to like throw across it. I think that'll help tie things in too. So. Stay tuned for some room updates here in the near future. So yeah, that's a little update. I'm gonna resume getting ready for tomorrow. All I need to do is wash my face and then I need to pack my work bag, which I'm about to do that right now. And then pack my work bag, pack my lunch slash snacks for tomorrow. Because I have a big meeting, lunch and breakfast is being provided. So I'm just gonna pack a couple snacks just to make sure, like a protein shake and maybe some nuts or a protein bar, just to make sure I have something. And then, um, what else? That's it. I'm gonna be done after that. So let's keep going. Get in the bed. 
I need to grab my brush so I can wrap my hair. Okay, let's go ahead and wrap this bad boy. So I took my braids out um, yesterday. I would have loved to have worn them for like another week, but they were just not looking as fresh as I would have liked them. And like I said, I have a couple of things at work this week and I'm meeting people for the first time. So I just want to kind of like look my best, you know? So I took them down yesterday and then ended up straightening my hair. So we're going to see kind of how my hair does with like working out and everything uh, this week and go from there. Hopefully it does pretty well but that's the other thing about like wearing your hair so I used to wear my natural hair all the time like when I was in college and a few years after college I wore my natural hair all the time and honestly I think I just got burnt out from doing it so much like natural hair is not low maintenance and I feel like I was just always doing it. I was always washing it. I was always twisting it. I was always just having to make sure something was done with my head. And so, I don't know. I've been wearing braids a lot recently over the last couple of years. My sister, she got a sew-in for the first time in a few years. And it looks really good, actually. So, I think I'm going to get a sew-in after the summer obviously not right now but during the fall I think I'm going to try a sew-in and just see how my hair does my I feel like my hair grew really fast with sew-ins as well not that like length isn't necessarily the goal though I mean I just want my hair to be healthy Whew. Whew. okay just have to rotate it around to make sure it's like nice and tight. Yo, okay. There we go. Now we can wash my face. Make sure you're washing your hands before you wash your face so you don't transfer bacteria y'all so to round out this video i thought i would just share a few things that have been on my heart and my mind lately particularly when it comes to how i'm showing up on a day-to-day -day basis my habits my routines and the things that i'm doing every single day to move me closer to my goal so i have the tendencies of a perfectionist i love a good plan and the problem with that is that at times I would be working so hard on trying to craft the per perfect plan and then when it came time to execute it, if it, I didn't execute it exactly how I envisioned it or exactly how I planned it, I felt like my plan wasn't good enough and I needed to change it. But the problem with that is you don't give yourself enough momentum to actually make significant progress on your goals because you're constantly moving the goalpost. So this is something that I am actively trying to work on, especially as I approach 30. I really want to be just the best me that I can be spiritually, physically, mentally, emotionally, professionally, etc. So I have set goals for myself for the next 12 weeks. I am trying out the 12 week year and I'll report back on how it's going, but but me uploading this video is progress because it's not what I planned. It doesn't look like I thought it was going to. But ultimately, I know that imperfect action beats perfect inaction. So that's really what I'm focused on over these next 12 weeks is being disciplined and staying consistent and doing what I said I was going to do, taking action consistently. So thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed today's video. We are at number two out of 10 and I will see you guys in the next one.